So this is a physics problem given on a physics contest for high school physics. And we have four light bulbs in this circuit. All of them are identical. So they all have the same resistance. And the question is, list the light bulbs in order of increasing brightness. Now we have one power source here with 12 volts. Can you solve the problem? Pause the video here and try it. When you're ready for the solution, hit play. All right, so let's look at each light bulb. And let's just say each light bulb has a resistance R. Since they are all the same, I'll just label it as a resistance R. Now let's follow the current. We'll do conventional current, starting from the positive terminal. And right here, we have a choice. So our path uh, moves either left or right. Okay? We can go this way to the left, or we can go this way to the right. Now, if we go to the right, that takes us all the way back to the battery. But if we went to the left, we then split again, either this way, which goes all the way back to the battery, or this way, which goes through another resistor and again back to the battery. So we have to look at our paths here that we're going to be taking. So first, if we go through uh, this path to the right, we only pass through one resistor. And so the resistance is R. But if we went to the left, first we pass through this second resistor, and then either resistors 1 and 4. So I can com combine the resistance of 1 and 4. Now since 1 and 4 are in parallel, I can write 1 over the resistance for 1 and 4, and this is just uh, finding equivalent resistance for parallel circuits, equals 1 over the resistance for 1, which I've labeled as just R, plus 1 over the resistance of 4, which again I've labeled as just R. So that would be 2 over R, so 1 over R14, we add those fractions, 2 over R, and take the reciprocal of both sides, we get that resistance as R over 2. Now, if we are to combine that resistance with the second resistor, this equivalent resistance is in series with that second resistor, as it doesn't matter which path you take, the path that goes to the left here at B will go through this resistor and this equivalent resistance that we just calculated. So if I wanted to figure out what R124 uh, is, take the resistance of R2, which is just R, and then add this equivalent resistance of 1, 4, which is R over 2. So that's a total resistance of 3 halves R. So what does this mean? That means if we go to the left here at B, we have a resistance of 3 over 2 R. But if we go to the right, we only pass through one resistance. So the resistance is just R. So, what that tells us is since that resistance at R3 is going to be less than the resistance of R124, the current I3 will be greater than the current that goes to I124, because we know um, electricity will follow the path of least resistance. So we already know here uh, that I3, the bulb number 3, will be the brightest because brightness depends on the current. All right, so if we go on a brightness scale, since we're supposed to write this with increasing brightness, increasing brightness, the brightest bulb is uh, number three. All right, we still have three more bulbs to put in here, one, two, and four. Well, if we look at the current that comes over here and turns 
to the left here, the current first goes through I2, or sorry, um, bulb 2, <laughs> let's call that current I2, and then it splits. Since the current splits, we know the current through I2 is going to be greater than the current that either goes through 1 or 4. Since the current through I2 is greater, the brightness is greater. So I'm going to put it here. All right, what about 1 and 4? Which brightness is greater? Well, since the bulbs have um, equal resistances, R and R, the current will be split equally. So the least bright bulbs will be 1 and 4, followed by 2, and followed by 3. Did you get it? Let me know in the comments.